A friend of mine asked me if I would be able to build at home a stencil printer for his electronics projects. I replied, maybe. And he asked me, and how much would it cost? And I replied, I have no idea. Let's do the following. You pay the materials, and I offer the job. This project took several months. I didn't know where to start. I saw several examples of some commercial and professional stencil printers on the internet. After that, I gradually formed a closer idea of how to start this project because I realized that the core of the process is always related to a very strong and solid structure. So I started by looking for an aluminium profile that could be the mainframe of the structure and I found the right profile in the small factory of aluminium windows and doors. The price was cheap. The next step was to start sketching the project. I chose the Design Spark Mechanical because it is very friendly and free to use. But while some parts will be easy to acquire, such as washers, screws, nuts, thread shafts and clip lock watchers, many others, due to their specificity, will have to be manufactured from the beginning. Some on the metal eight and others on the mill but the machining of the parts will be going to make the whole process more expensive, time-consuming and much more labored, especially those that required milling work. So, I had the idea of using a 3D printer to make some parts. I had doubts about the strength of plastic especially if it was a structure that requires a lot of precision. But fortunately I found that PLA is very resistant and serves this purpose very well. The pieces can also perfectly fit in the shape of aluminium profile without any clearance. Thus I machined only a few parts in the metal aid and I made the rest on a 3D printer. Even the threads can be included from the beginning in the sketch of the parts. By this way you will can save a lot of time. And the tightening is also very strong.
So here are my friend using this homemade stencil printer and showing the steps for the picky process of distributing solder points on a PCB. Mm -hmm. 